Hello, my name is Nick Ju, Research and Development Engineer here at Big Kaiser. I'll be showing you a brief machining demonstration on a comparison between a Big Plus tool holder and non-Big Plus tool holder when it comes to rigidity. On an Akuma Genos M560 Vertical Machining Center, we'll be using two of our high power milling chuck tool holders both with a 12 millimeter four flute flat end mill cutter installed to mill three 12 millimeter slots on a block of 4140 steel. The two HMC holders have identical clamping diameters and gauge lengths. The only difference is that the first one on the left is a standard Cat 40 non-Big Plus shank, whereas the second holder has a Big Plus Cat 40 shank. The slot on the left, designated slot one, will be milled in one pass with the non-Big Plus Cat 40 high power milling chuck at four millimeters axial cutting depth and full slot radial engagement. The middle slot, or slot two, will be milled with identical cutting depths as well as identical feeds and speeds, but with the Big Plus version of our high power milling chuck. The final slot, slot three, will be machined with the same Big Plus HMC holder and end mill, but we will increase the axial cutting depth by 50% as well as the feed rate by 50% to show the increased performance capabilities with Big Plus. So let's start machining. First, the standard Cat 40 non-Big Plus high power milling chuck tool holder is loaded into the spindle to mill slot one. Chatter is immediately audible during this cut. Next, the Big Plus HMC holder is loaded into the spindle to mill the second slot. The same machining parameters as the first slot are used. No audible chatter noise is generated during this cut. Finally, we'll increase the depth of cut and feed rate both by 50%. Still no audible chatter is heard while cutting this third slot. Let's take a closer look at the finishes on each slot. On slot 1, where the standard non-Big Plus tool holder was used, there is significant chatter markings on the machined surfaces. Using a surface roughness tester to measure the wall surface of this slot, an RA value of about five microns was obtained. The material removal rate, or MMR, which denotes the volume of material removed per unit of time, is set as the reference 100% for this demonstration. On slot two, where the Big Plus HMC holder was used, the surface finish does not show any major chatter marks. Measuring the wall surface with the roughness tester, a significantly improved RA value of less than one micron was achieved. The MMR is the same 100% for this slot, since the feeds and speeds were unchanged from slot one. For the third slot, which used the same big plus holder, but with 50% greater depth of cut and 50% faster feed rate, the finish is still superior to slot one. An RA of about one micron was measured on the wall surface of this slot. Because of the Big Plus tool holder's greater rigidity, the MMR for this slot was able to be increased to 225% compared to the 100% of slot one and slot two, which gives a great advantage to machining efficiencies and cycle time reductions. So that's a simple example of how Big Plus can greatly improve your material removal rates while still retaining superior finishes in milling, leading to greater performance and efficiency. I hope this was helpful.